Hello Tots. In this week's story, we learn about Bible superhero Elijah and the amazing time when God sent a huge fire to show that he was the one true God. We're going to have a go at making a picture of a fire. For this, I've got some twigs and a few leaves that I've picked up in the park and perhaps you could do the same. You could go with a grown up and get some twigs and if you get lots of leaves that will be enough probably to make the whole picture. But I'm, I'm also going to use some tissue paper which I've cut out into the shape of flames. So I've got yellow and I've got red and I've got orange. So the first thing to do is to put some of the twigs on your piece of paper down near the bottom of the piece of paper. And you'll need to stick these on with some sticky tape so they don't fall off. Okay, there we are. One bit of sticky potato. And I'm going to put on another piece over here. Here, yeah, and then a little more. Okay, now I'm going to put some of the leaves on, and for that, I'm going to use some glue. I'm going to put quite a nice bit of glue on the paper and then stick the leaves on. Put some over here some down here and some over here that's good and then we take the we need more glue on the paper ready to stick our flames on okay. I'm going to put some of the yellow flames on first over here and then some of the orange on top of that then you see how it's going does that look a little bit like a fire let's add some more more tissue paper flames as well okay and one over here There, that looks a bit like a fire, but I'm sure you can do one that looks much better than this as well. And if you don't have twigs and leaves and tissue paper, there's lots of other ways you could do a picture of a fire, perhaps with crayons or paints or felt pens. When you've had a go at doing a picture of a fire, we'd love to see it. So do, do upload it, do put a photo on the Hope Tots Parents WhatsApp page.